Stacked disc filter modules have long been used in food and beverage applications as a convenient and cost-effective alternative to flat sheet filter presses. Their high dirt holding capacity and filtration performance make them a leading solution in multiple filtration situations. And because of their modular design, filter changeout is quicker and simpler, making them the preferred choice in many liquid-based manufacturing processes. However, despite their impact, performance limitations still exist and in response, Paul have developed a second generation of sheet-based filter modules that specifically target these technical challenges. Paul SupraDisc 2 modules have been designed to increase process stability, improve safety and further reduce operating cost. To understand the advancements of the updated design, we need to review the differences in their construction. Typically, classic lenticular modules are manufactured leaving the media fully exposed within the filter housing. Cells comprise of two sheets of depth filter media, with a polypropylene separator between them. The separator is pressed inside the cell and a polypropylene seal around the outside edge binds the components into a single unit. The filtrate flows from the outside surface of the filter media to the inside and exits the module via the central core. Drawbacks of this classic module design include a reduction in filtration area due to blinding. This occurs when portions of the cells touch each other as a result of deformation and warping during steaming, rinsing or hot filtration. The rupture of unsupported media caused by back pressure in the system. Back flushing is not possible because of lack of upstream support of the filter media. Even polypropylene fleeces or nets designed to increase pressure stability offer insufficient security against module damage and the increased possibility of accidental damage. Due to the exposed nature of the filter media, tearing or contamination during shipping, handling and installation remains a potential risk. The innovative design of the SupraDisc 2 modules decisively addresses these issues. By enclosing each filter cell in its own cage assembly, every media sheet is separated and supported by the rigid polypropylene structure. A bonding process using ultrasonic welding seals the outer edge, directing the flow of the filtrate through the designated separator channels. With both upstream and downstream support, the media resists deformation and cell collapse and back flushing of filter modules becomes possible. SupraDisc 2 modules minimise operational cost and maximise efficiency, with benefits over classic stacked disc designs that include Longer filter life due to the reduced risk of cell or module deformation from sanitization, steaming or hot operation. Increased filter efficiency due to the elimination of blinding and the complete utilization of every filter sheet. Higher operational security due to the resilience against vacuum or back pressure shocks. Easier handling before and after operation due to external protection of the filter media and higher throughput due to the regenerability of modules with back flushing. Additionally, a full range of filter housings for SupraDisc 2 modules are available from Paul to accommodate from one to four filter modules. For further information and details on SupraDisc 2 module types, please visit the Paul website or contact your local representative.